please, pretty please, very pretty. No, absolutely not. I am not paying for that. If you need two of anything else, call me. <laughs> what were you going to give me for graduation? A hug without hurting myself. <laughs> You know that pair of ballet slippers you've been promising me every Christmas since I was nine? I'll get you the slippers. I don't want the slippers. I just want the pair. <laughs> Penny, if you had big breasts, you would not want them. I have had to put up with too many guys asking me out just for that reason. I mean, volleyball games stopping cold because I walk by. Men missing their buses because of me. Sailors who have... Oh, no, shut up! <laughs> Penny, Penny, you'll get over this. Remember when I took you to that Ozzy Osbourne concert and then you begged me to buy you a guitar and a live bat? For Christmas, I bought you the guitar. You never played it. I took real good care of the bat. You have asked me for a lot of things, Penny, but this is too much. Hey, Penny, this is a big decision. Won't you have one done? See if you like it. We're talking about cap teeth here. We're talking about breast additions. Well, then I got a question. Just where would these additional breasts go? If you knew how important this was to me, you'd do it. Penny, this is a phase. You will get over it. Just like you got over the bat. Hey, I love that bat! <laughs> oh, so if this one guy asked you out, you wouldn't be asking me for $3,000. Daddy, it is not just one guy. What's wrong with trying to improve your looks? All the men, all the jobs, all of life's opportunities go to the better looking. Get in the 80s. If you don't like the way something is, you change it. Obviously, she's never been married. <laughs> You're not a child anymore, Penny. I can't tell you what to do. I can only advise you. As the man who has spent his life's blood raising you, this is a foolish and impulsive thing to do with nothing whatsoever to recommend it. But I'm not telling you what to do. Always remember that. You're not writing me a check, are you? I'm sorry, Penny. That would be wrong. Fine. But let my chest be on your head. <laughs> What'll it be? Iced tea. Straight up. <laughs> uh, lemon? Please. Oh. <laughs> Forgive me. <laughs> Sugar? Do. <Dew. laughs> Penny, I love what you've done with your hair. With my hair. Honey, it looks smaller. <laughs> Do you guys notice anything different about me? Notice what? I don't notice anything. Do you notice anything, Cliff? No, no, not me. Then again, it's hard to see when there's been a total eclipse of the sun. <laughs> you notice? Girl, the only difference between you and a camel is that you could probably go longer without water. <laughs> Penny, I had no idea you were so serious about this. I'm a very serious girl. Hey, hey, hey! Hey, Uncle Luke! <laughs> Penny, is that you standing so far away? What do you think? Oh, no, no way, not me. <laughs> when a woman asks about her body, she only wants to hear one thing. And I have never figured out what that is. I can't say I approve of this, but I can't turn away a new member. Welcome to the club. Thanks. Tell a friend. <laughs> Soon you'll be receiving your membership card, your Lonnie Anderson decoder ring, <laughs> and your What Color Are My Shoes t-shirt. <laughs> Hi, Daddy. 
Penelope Rachel Waters, you get in here. I am in here. She was in here before she got in here. You didn't. Yep. I saw the wizard on Park and 73rd. They were having a growing out of B cup sale. <laughs> Did your mother pay for this? No, Aunt Ursula. Aunt Ursula's dead, and now I'm glad. You know the trust fund she set up for me? Well, it's matured. Now so am I. <laughs> that trust fund was for your education, to broaden your horizons. <laughs> well, they broadened. <laughs> I'm gonna get noticed everywhere. I could run for Congress and win. How could you run anywhere without knocking yourself silly? <laughs> I'd take you over my knee, but we'd probably both crash through the floor. Daddy, you said you couldn't tell me what to do anymore. That's right, I did. But let me say this. It is not going to change your life. I understand. You're going after that guy in geology class, aren't you? Absolutely. <laughs> Hi, Joe. Hi, Sam. Penny, I see your dough has risen. <laughs> Nothing says loving like something from the oven. <laughs> Sam, can you believe this? Thanks for the memory. <laughs> You told him. So paranoid. <laughs> so, Sam, what's new? Why are you looking at me like that? This is the way I always look at you. Well, stop it. 